The Boston police officer who was shot tonight was taken to Boston Medical Center. And that's where WBC's Julie McDonald picks up our team coverage tonight. And Julie, what is the scene looking like there? Well, David and Lisa, there is a lot going on over here on Albany Street. This street completely blocked off on either side outside of the ER. Traffic around the hospital being diverted in other directions. And you can see that was to make way for this clear route to the ER to get treatment for this officer. There are dozens of police here, Boston police, state police, uniformed, in plain clothes, all of them, uh, and rows and rows of cruisers taking up this Albany Street outside of the entrance here. We've unfortunately been at this kind of scene before, and there always is a tense uh, mood as we learn, as we wait to learn more about that officer's condition. But also, when you think that all of the police who were, uh, who are here tonight, all began their shift in the city the same way this evening, so always a really um, somber feeling just when the realities of this job. Um, are reminded once again. Um, we know that investigators have told us that they will be releasing more information shortly. We will bring that to you live during this newscast and if not on WBZ this morning. Right now we're live outside Boston Medical Center. I'm Julie McDonald, WBZ News. Julie, thank you. So